Hello, fight fans. I'm Hector Sanchez from InTheRing.net. I'm here with none other than Maurice Mighty Mo Hooker, the former junior welterweight champion of the world. Mo, thanks for being on the show. Mo, it's been a little over a year since your last fight. How eager are you to get back into the ring? Uh, this fight right here is perfect, you know. Perfect opponent. We got a guy who's a, who's a good fighter. Fast talker. And uh, I think he, he bring out the best in you know, so. I've been training hard. I'm ready for whatever he brings. And I'm pretty sure he's been training hard. Speaking of training, uh, you're training out of the Terrence Crawford camp. Uh, How does it feel training with uh, the, uh, the welterweight champ? You know, I've been there before. Before I fight for my world title at 140, I was training along, you know, beside him. He gave me for Jeff Owen, and I gave me for Terrence uh, Flanagan. You know, and I was in camp with him, you know. So I've been in camp with him a few times, you know. And uh, we got Vic, I mean, post school and everybody. And uh, it felt like family, you know. It felt right, you know. Him, Coach Reed, Coach Des uh, I am, you know, because about me, I feel like family, I feel like it's the place to be, to learn, you know, and to, to, to better myself. And uh, I just decided to go with them, I know they push me, you know, to be my beast. Right, I saw Terrence giving you some tips there and telling you some things to work on. Uh, let's talk about uh, your opponent, uh, Blair the Flair Cobbs. This is a southpaw. Uh, tell us a little something about what you've learned about him or... Uh, what have you seen about him that uh, you're going to do in the ring on Saturday night? I mean, he's a good fighter. He, he, moves, he moves a lot. You know, he, he's a good fighter. I can't tell you everything. He's a good fighter. And uh, I just be ready. I just be ready for whatever he brings. You know, I'm working to be my best. He can do what he wants. He can do what he wants and do what he can. As long as I you know, do what I do and be my best at it, nobody can beat me. So I'm just focused focus on me right now and only me. I'm not worried about Black Cloud. I don't care what he brings, and I don't care what, I don't care what he do in the ring.
okay, you're only four days away from the, the fight. How does it feel to be fighting back here in Dallas, Texas, in front of all your fans? I mean, I'm happy, you know. I'm happy, you know. That time I fought here, it didn't go my way. I broke my hand. But this time, I'm ready to get the win. It's a good fight. Get Dallas, Texas, where I'm from. And some before where people, good fight. You know, I'm going, coming in there, be my best, and have a good night. And celebrate my birthday, Sunday. Absolutely. Okay, uh, Cobb, is he going to have any flair after this fight? I mean, he, he's like a humble guy. I don't know nothing about him. Uh, we're going to see. He never, he never found about with power. He never found about with speed. He never found about who can bang with him. He never found about who can outbox him. So we're going to see. You know, I don't know too much about him. I don't know how he's going to feel after the fight. But we should, we should see. We'll find out. Well, great. Well, thank you, Mo. Appreciate the interview. Uh, welcome back to Dallas, and all your Dallas fans are going to be looking forward to seeing you on Saturday night.